across the limestone coast could jump by more than $420 per year. He comes as the energy regulator looks to potentially raise the default market offer by July 1. They'll release a draft this week on how much maximum retail electricity fees can go up. The federal government says without their price cap, things could be made much worse. A Mount Gambier man will be sentenced next month for the murder of a one-month-old baby. A court has heard Trent Masling, who has seven children with four different women, had been up all night smoking cannabis during June 2016. The following morning, the baby woke him crying and he proceeded to shake her in frustration. The little girl suffered critical brain injuries and died 17 months later. Masling is pleading guilty to manslaughter. He'll be sentenced next month. Rental properties in regional Victoria and South Australia are like hen's teeth, with the latest stats showing how hard it is to secure a rental property. That's despite a slight easing up in the market, but prop track analyst Paul Ryan doesn't think there'll be any significant improvement for the rest of the year. We kind of need more rental stock to come on the market, and that's going to take some time. So it's going to be really tough for renters for, for probably most of 2023, unfortunately. Locals are again being warned about people offering to lay bitumen at a fraction of the regular price. Port Macdonald residents were approached last week with three men in high-vis tops approaching properties in unmarked dual-cab work utes. They fled the scene when questioned where they were from but did leave a business card. New lay surfacing was registered just eight weeks ago in New South Wales with Victorians also reporting problems with the company. After this, there is no turning back. You sip the red can, the story ends. You sip the black can, you enter dreamland. And I show you just how good the truth can taste. <laughs> Take the Pepsi Max Taste Challenge. now and we're building towards another big season of the NBL One South. The Mount Gambier Pioneers in full training now to ensure they're in top form for the season opener on April 1. That's when they hit the road to take on the Sandringham Sabres. Both the men's and women's squads are looking to go just a couple of spots better than last year to claim league glory. Join the community that helps make wishes come true. Visit makeawish.org.au to make your donation today. That's makeawish.org.au Buying or selling rural or residential properties? Villa One and John. This is SAFM Weather. Partly cloudy for the limestone coast today with light winds reaching a top of 22 degrees. Tuesday mostly sunny and 25. Get free breaking news about our community. Download the listener app, search for the limestone coast and add to your favourites now.